Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Thank you so much for clicking on here. If you're new here, my name is Karina and I do fashion and styling videos as well as some hauls and I also do weekly vlogs. So if you're interested in any of that, please consider subscribing down below. Today's video is gonna be another style talk, which is a series of mine where I pick an item of clothing and I style it for you many different ways. That way you get some inspo or some ideas of how to wear this particular item. Uh, today we're going to do a trench coat because I actually had a request to do this last year or the, the end of last year and I hadn't gotten around to doing it. So I'm doing it today. The trench coat that I'll be using is one that I purchased from Forever 21 quite some time ago, actually over a year ago. So um, I will link some similar ones down below. And I also have another one from Just Fab, uh, but both of them are pretty old. So I'll link some similar items down below. With My first pairing here is with a white button up shirt. I tend to gravitate for kind of menswear inspired outfits when I go for a trench coat because it kind of gives that men's wear look. I did tennis shoes to keep it casual, but because a trench coat elevates the look, I definitely wanted to add my little fancier bag with it. Never break, always fight, never quit. Here I just switched out the jeans for these straight leg, more relaxed jeans. Did a French tuck with a white shirt, and then I added my black combat boots to just give it more of an edgy, relaxed feel. Not so structured as the last one, and essentially still the same outfit, but you can just change out the look by changing out the jeans and changing out the shoes. Okay, here is an all black classic look to wear with a trench coat. I did leather pants or faux leather pants and then a black dressy shirt and heels because I wanted this look to be more of a dressier vibe. And I did switch out my trench coat for the more structured one I have. This is the Just Fab one. It's in an extra, extra small, so it's pretty snug. I am doing a couple all black looks just to show you how you can just change it up. It doesn't have to be dressy. Here I did a distressed jean with a black uh, turtleneck shirt, which you really can't tell it's a turtleneck. And I did these kind of like nude or tan colored trainers. But you can just change out the shoes like I'm going to show you in the next clip. Keeping it still very casual, I just switched out the type of shoe. So it's still a sneaker, still very casual, but I went with these high top or mid-rise Nike Court Royals. Okay, I promise this is the last shoe change with this all black look and I did these mules from Amazon I love these mules so much. I actually have some black ones coming that are just closed off from the back But again with the masculine feel these mules give me that Okay, please excuse the variation of color in the frame It just happens when I move around especially when I switch out the colors here I am wearing a white shirt dress from Shein and I wanted to show you that you could just belt the trench coat as well. So if you're wearing something that's not very structured at the bottom, belting it or like tightening up the belt that gives you some shape is really a good idea to do with something like a dress like this. Pairing it with some tall boots and then just adding an uh, all black bag to it, keeping the very neutral kind of palette going on. Here I've paired it with a sweater dress. Now you can do any color sweater dress because of the trench coat being so neutral. But I chose to do this uh, dress that I've gotten from Target recently. It's black and white. It's a nice neutral palette still. And so I threw on a pop of color with this little Walmart bag. I love, love, love this bag. I think the green is just so great for like the fall and winter and it pairs beautifully with this neutral look. Okay, here is a very casual look. One of my favorite ways of pairing this also. Just a little cute workout set. This one's from Amazon. Um, something you can just throw on and go like run errands, maybe throw a baseball cap on, throw your little crossbody on. And you could do this with this kind of tennis shoe. You could do a trainer with like the high crew socks or whichever look you like as far as the sneakers go. Okay, another little Amazon set and here's where I switch out the bottom part. I, like I said, you could do like crew socks like this, 
you could do Converse, you could do the dad sneaker, whichever shoe you're into, you could definitely do with these sets. Just switch it out and see what you like the best. Again, maybe throw on a baseball cap or a beanie, depending on how cool it is. And if your trench coat is a little bit thicker, you could totally do that as well. Here's a warmer option to a set. Um, so instead of wearing the little tight workout set, you can do a more casual sweatsuit set in any color of your choice. Uh, same thing with the sneakers. Pick the sneaker choice that you would like or feel more comfortable in. Throw a little crossbody, and I would definitely do a beanie if I'm doing this versus like a cap. Okay, here I wanted to pair it more for like going out or maybe going out for drinks. Thinking a little bit outside the box, I have this oversized button down striped shirt that I got from Shein in the men's section and I've just been trying to find ways to pair it because I really love the print but again it's oversized so putting a trench coat on there really helps okay I stuck with the faux leather leggings and threw on my combat boots and then this oversized graphic tee and I feel like when you wear something very oversized like this tee or that previous shirt Putting on a jacket and or a trench coat on top gives it a little bit of structure so it gives it some shape and you don't feel as like frumpy or you don't feel like you're just wearing something too oversized. I know, I know I am giving spring and we're not there yet, but a trench coat is your quintessential jacket when it comes to transitioning from spring, I'm sorry, from winter to spring. And I feel like this look is just giving and I'm here for it. Lastly, I'm doing a denim on denim look, which I think breaks up nicely with the trench coat color. I'm doing the mules again, and you can't really tell that my top is denim, but it is a very light like chambray. And then I do a light color denim bottom, but really loving this look. And I did a little French tuck. Okay, those were the ways that I would style a trench coat. There is a ton of different ways, obviously, to style one, but I think a trench coat is essential in someone's wardrobe because it can definitely elevate an outfit and give an outfit a very different like vibe or aesthetic. So if you're on the fence on purchasing one or you have one and don't really know how to style it, I hope this video was helpful and gets you to wearing it more or gets you to purchase one if you don't already own one. If you have any requests, please leave them down below. So if you don't already follow me on my social medias like TikTok and Instagram, definitely do so because I do like to post inspo on there as well. And so until the next one, I will see you guys later.